We have a significant risk-taking capacity. We've been investing 1 billion euros each year for, for the past three years, which is exactly a half of what we have done in the total existence here of EBRD in Ukraine for 20 years. So clearly, the big question is, can we uh, keep that pace of investment uh, only if the private sector uh, finds the conditions and the investment climate here positive enough to go in. The good news is, and I would very much like to pick up on what Mark said earlier, is that whatever money we put on the table today is an investment into the future of Ukraine rather than the past of Ukraine. Like uh, Mark, we too took significant risks after Russia crisis 98. Large majority of, of those investments proved to be the best ever EBRD investments in the whole region. After this crisis, 2008-2009, uh, we again, as I mentioned, accelerated the pace and the portfolio is actually performing very well. So I hope that also those investments, and we have also increased equity portion in the portfolio, uh, I also hope that these investments will, will turn out very well generally. And clearly grain is, if you're asking for specific sectors, grain or foodstuff is going to be a, a massive potential. Uh, this planet will, will have uh, 9 billion uh, people uh, pretty soon, and there is significant increase for uh, need demand for food. And Ukraine is one of the three countries in the, in the world globally that can actually satisfy that. That's number one. Number two, we do hope that with energy efficiency improvements also the, the metals and steel sector can bounce back, and the demand globally is, is, is about to go up, I believe. Um, and finally, the capital markets. So, you know, not only the, uh, the investments into fixed assets, but also financial investments. Uh, the capital markets in Ukraine clearly can, can, can improve, and there is a much greater upside than there is downside. To final optimistic note, mm -hmm. I would like to say we are signing two new investments into Ukraine today, one being in fuel and one being in food. So that also indicates where the money is going.